I don't assume that you've ever been a chemist, have you, Brenna? No, I haven't. Well, today you're going to be a chemist, and you're going to help me find out whether antacid tablets really work. Okay, how are we going to do that? Well, we're going to use a universal indicator, but first, see that knob? Yes. We'll turn it on. This is an electric stove, but we're not using the heating part. We're using another sort of hidden part. See it? Oh, look at the magnet. It's yeah. spinning around. Underneath is a magnet spinning, and that makes this magnet spin around. And mm -hmm. so... Look at the little tornado. Yeah, that shows that it's spinning around. And chemists use this so they don't have to stand and stir something. Yeah. Now we're going to add some universal indicator. I'd like you to put in 24 drops. And I'll tell you about universal indicator in a moment. Now you have to be very precise. You get exactly 24 drops in there. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, yeah. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. 24. <laughs> Fortunately, it's not that critical. I think you may have had an extra drop or two <laughs> there, but it's all right. Now, remember I told you that was a universal indicator. See the yeah. color? Yeah, oh, it's yellow. Yeah. Now. Here's a chart that I made up for you. See if you can understand. Scientists call the test for acidity or something that's basic the pH. And the smallest numbers are the most acid. Oh. And with our universal indicator, see the color? Red. Okay. Now we're going to get m less acid and less acid. Can you see what happens to the yeah, color? Yeah, it goes all the way from red down Orange, to blue. yellow, Green. greenish, and blue. Yeah. And down here, we're quite basic. Yeah. So we can tell by looking at the color whether we're counteracting the acid or not. So far, we haven't added any acid. In view of your um, miscount, do you mind if I do the acid? No. Okay. One, two, three. I think I was as oh, bad as you are. I miscounted too. Changed colors. Yes. So well, now you saw, remember in that chart, red was the most acid, right? Yeah. Okay. Now, here are antacid pills. So put them in there. That this pills are supposed yeah, to still make the, same. the acid go. Away. Right. That's supposed to make the acid go away. But you must remember, uh, the stomach acid is very important because that helps you digest yeah. food and you want your acid in the stomach. But sometimes people get too much, they think, and so they sometimes call it heartburn, yeah. and they have, say, feel a sort of aching, and so they take these antacid pills to sort of counteract it. So we can find out now whether it really changes stomach acid uh, from an acid to a more basic. You see any change? Well, it this used to be as red, red. It? yeah, it's a little, a little orangey. Orangey. Turning paler and paler. Paler and paler. Well, keep an eye on because yeah. once it happens, it happens very quickly. There oh, it goes. There Look it goes. Yellow. Yellow green. green. And greenish blue. Blue, yeah. It turns yeah. and goes really fast. Right. So, as a chemist, would you say that stomach uh, acid counteractors like uh, antacids really work? Yeah, they do. Good. 